Hello, welcome to another Mr. T Tales Tales. I'm sure by week nine you're all sat there now with your first lockdown haircut, probably given by your mum or your granny if she lives with you, or uh, in my case, my 14 year old daughter uh, with a beard trimmer, which was very brave of me, I think. But today I'm going to introduce you to a poem. The poem is a very famous poem, it must be ooh, over 30 years now, uh, by Alan Alberg, and it's called Please, Mrs. Butler. Every class I've taught over the last few years has, by the end of the year, memorised this poem. I think the poem is so popular because everybody knows a boy like Derek Drew. Everybody knows a child who keeps complaining. And also, everybody has had that moment when they've seen a teacher absolutely lose their patience. So why don't you see if you can memorise this poem? This is Please, Mrs Butler by Alan Alberg. Please, Mrs Butler. This boy, Derek Drew, keeps copying my work, miss. What shall I do? Go and sit in the hall, dear. Go and sit in the sink. Take your books on the roof, my lamb. Do whatever you think. Please, Mrs Butler. This boy, Derek Drew, keep taking my rubber, miss. What shall I do? Hide it in your hand, dear. Hide it up your vest. Swallow it if you like, my love. Do what you think best. Please, Mrs Butler. This boy, Derek Drew, keeps calling me rude names, miss. What shall I do? Lock yourself in the cupboard, my dear. Run away to sea. Do what you can, my flower, but don't ask me. 